Hi, in today's tutorial you learn how to set up an IRS project in Xcode and you start our mobile SDK. You will see how to complete those steps for new projects using our CA Technologies template and later for existing projects using Apple's template. The first step is to open Xcode and create a new project. In the last video, we learned how to CA technology templates can help us to create a new project and all the benefits they bring to us. I will use the basic application template. I will call this app Simple App, Simple Chat, and I will use Objective C as a language. Once the project is created, we can move on to the second step. It is time to add our mobile SDK to this project. If you haven't downloaded the SDK, please do so by going to our website, nasca.com, clicking the Get Started page, and scroll down to step 5. Here you'll find a link to download our mobile SDK. The version of the SDK used in this video is composed by five frameworks, as you can see here, and also one bundle file. For this simple app, I just need the Mass Foundation framework, once it is the one responsible for starting the SDK. So let me drag and drop Mass Foundation framework into the projects folder in Xcode. The last step is the configuration file. The version of the SDK used in this video uses a configuration file to restart the SDK and connect to our gateway. You can ask your server administrator to generate the file for you. Let's drag and drop the configuration file into the projects folder in Xcode as well. Copy items if necessary. Remember to check that always. Done. We have successfully completed the setup integration of the app in our mobile SDK. So let's run the app and see what happened. Allow location. Perfect. As you can see, in just three simple steps and in less than one minute, we were able to create a project and integrate with our SDK without even writing one line of code. But all that was only possible because we are using CA Technologies template to create this app. It not only comes with all the settings done but also a simple code to start the SDK, as you can see here. Now I will show you how to integrate our SDK with existing project. For that, I will be using a project I have here called Simple Chat 2. As you can see by the folder structure, this project was not created using our template. I will follow the same steps we did to create a new app using the template. I will drag and drop the SDK and the configuration file. Only mass foundation for this video. Always copy items if necessary. And now the configuration file. Now let's import mass foundation in our code and start the SDK. Port Mass Foundation. And call Mass Start.
Let me run the app and see if it works. As you can see, something's still missing. Because this project was not created using our template, another two steps are necessary. The project list file and the project building settings. Let me start by the project building settings. I'm going to go by project, target, building settings and look for other thinker. Okay, so here I need to add Objective-C. Now let's go to the plist file and compare this one with the application we just created with the template. As you can see, there are two entries here. So I will just copy them and paste in the, my application. Now let me try to run the app again. Perfect. Now the app ran successfully. Remember that you can always go back to our website for more details. Here in the docs, guides, you will find all the necessary information you need to set up a project or existing one and use our mobile SDK. Thanks for watching.